We are back with another Demon Slayer episode reaction. Only two episodes left. After this, next week's the season finale. Yeah. Which is crazy to think about. We're almost done. No! 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 Last week, we ended off with what looked like it was going well for Tengen at first, and it looked like it was going well for Inosuke, for Sleeping Zenitsu, for Tanjiro. And Tanjiro was able to use both water and sun breathing at the same time. That was sick. That, that was, was really cool. And you've been predicting that yes. since we started that this was, fight. I, I just predicted that it would be cool to see. And, then it, and it was cool to see. And then even Inosuke cut off the head and was able to start running away with it. I never thought that he would get stabbed in the back. Yeah, so I, what I'm thinking now is that he can transport himself to her head. Like, it's oh, like... Oh, because of the eye? Yeah. That makes so much sense because even Tondra was like, what the heck just happened? And Inosuke, it was like, it just happened so quick. And I mean, we know they're fast. Mm -hmm. We know that. But still. And you can see their growth because they're able to keep up with the demons. Mm -hmm. Like, Tondra's able to keep up with At this. At least watch this, him. Yeah. yeah. And so it's uh, it's like we are talking last week. It's a little bit different from the fight with Rengoku where they're just like watching blurs. Like, I can't even get involved in this fight. Mm -hmm. And now they're actually able to compete in it. Unfortunately... It looked like it was going good. And at the end of the episode, they really downed you out. Tengen even lost a hand. Yeah. Someone needs to show up, whether it's a Hasha or someone else, to um, give him an extra hand. They, yeah. <laughs> and if you want to give us a hand, hit that subscribe button. Yay! Uh, <laughs> Let's freaking stop it, though. <laughs> but ne they do need Nesco. Yeah. They need her to That's get that move. So if they get her, the, they will have a hand. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> And then we thought maybe that Nezuko has the ability to take the poison at Tengen because he had it, but now with the arm missing, the, uh, the hand missing too, I don't even know. I, I never would have predicted this was going to happen. Unless that's a shadow clone or something. I don't know. Ooh. That would be cool. Oh, damn it. Nope. I didn't think about that. Or a Genjutsu or yeah. something like an in, like we know from Naruto. Yeah. Okay. Hey, now I'm a little a little more upbeat about this. <laughs> that's pretty good. Hey, I'm just saying, you know, you know what I mean? Well, let's find out. Let's just jump into the reaction. Let's get it. Destroyer of demons, and yet he got his hand cut off. That's savage. Oh. Oh, I forgot she cut up again. Zinet, I don't know what Zenith is going to do. You can't blame yourself. Not your fault. You're not Superman. Dude, for a second, I thought he lost his hand, too. But I forgot it's wrapped up. <laughs> no, I just... Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's just... Like, is this Ooh. irony? Everybody's losing hands? And they better... Demons better not use that joke either. Dude, what if they did and they said, want to catch these hands and they threw Tengen's hand? <laughs> Dude, I'm sorry. That is... That's kind of... Dude, this is... I would be like, that's good. And then like, oh. That's, that's, like, oh, that's good. Mm. That's real good. Never give up. Never oh, surrender. Right. Never give up, Tanjiro. You hit the ground hard, buddy. Nesco's got to come out. It was all a dream. It was all a dream. He keeps going back here. I don't know. Facts. Man, dropping. Well, that's true. Okay. This is the demon cell talking? Is she talking? I think she's really talking to him in real life. No? How is he able to do that that's the first time he saw nezuko in his dream as she currently is yeah dang he was asleep for a minute dude that slice did all that or did they just do more stuff while he was unconscious they had to have just started doing dude, that where is everybody what the heck oh we mentioned this last week it could be sibling versus sibling mm -hmm. you can relate or no? I thought he was going to be emotional about it. Oh. Oh. Wait, so is his sister older? Oh. I don't know, but I think he's mocking him because he's better than than him. Like, I can protect my sister. Oh. Yeah. oh. He's pointing at himself. Dang. Come on, Nezco. Oh, man. He's not going to get it very far. 
Oh, wow. Dude, this quality is so good right now. I know. This is kind of giving me vibes of like Ruri. Again, Ruri was all about being a, a protective older brother. Yeah. But he was so just cruel. What is that? Oh my goodness, his fingers. He can't do anything. Ah. He's just torturing him. No. Headbutt him. Please headbutt him. Yay. Yes. <laughs> Did eyes get bloodshot again? Or they've been bloodshot? I think they've been bloodshot. Why does it work? Oh, he threw the point. He threw a kunai probably. He just kept throwing little things. Yes. Oh. Nailed him. Oh, Winnie had but. Just like when he fought you. Dang. Fighting when it looks like he's wow. running away. Wow. Hey, man. He's playing chess up here. Oh. Never give up. Okay. Stop. He's able to sun breathe still. Did he just do it? Did he do it? I was worried Doki was gonna interfere. I'm wondering about if he if that is it. Oh no, he didn't get it. Oh, he's seen himself. Mm. Oh. Now he's seeing it as a favor. No. If Nezuko would come out and step on it, or Tengen. Dude, Nezuko. Oh. Oh. Set your hearts ab ablaze in a flash. Nice. Hey, here we go. He said round two, girl. He said, I ain't done yet. I wonder if he was waiting too. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Yes. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's almost got it. Speed. Faster. Come on. They're both on the edge. Yes. He really did. Man, I wish he had another kunai right now. Dang. No. There's no way, man. Oh, that's so defeating. Don't give up. It's incredible he can keep up, though. Let's keep holding out. Oh, dang. He's back. He's still back? Dude, he's, he's been watching Zoro fight. Oh. This guy's insane. Wait, what did he say? Oh, like music. Oh, wow. Oh, this song is dope. Oh, wow. Dude, look. You so dude. good. I want to see his wife throw some more kunai at him. I want to see this guy get destroyed. Woohoo! <laughs> Dang! They probably... Dude, this is wild. With one hand. Dang! Dude! This is crazy. What do they call it? The crescendo? Where's the crescendo? This is the climax, man, right here. Dude! He is on fire, bro! Oh, How is he right keeping there. up? Oh, his head. Water wheel? Sun breathing? What is it gonna be? Both. Oh, he broke the sword. Oh. <sighs> what the? Tengen's gonna. Oh my goodness. That's wild. No breathing? Tangan's gonna finish it off. 
That's, oh man. What, what the heck? Whoa. Bro, what? So that scar really is like his dad's? I knew it. What? He's not done. How's he able to travel that fast? What? What? What the wow. heck? I knew he was double jointed and stuff, but what? I can believe that. Nope, 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 not he today. He coming this time. Nope. Yes. That's satisfying. That's probably the most satisfying thing I've seen so far. In an anime. Oh my goodness. In a long time. I tell you what. Hey, you it's about time. You had it coming. <laughs> oh poetic. Yeah. Look at each other while you're dying. What? Now they show up? Well they they wouldn't have been able to do anything. Oh no, he Tinkins. Dude, they are just utterly Oh, I forgot he got yeah, poison too. Nezuko has to do something. Maybe they can do something. It's not over. Oh. I think that was like his final. Wow. His self destruct button. Yeah, it's kind of like the self destruct button. That was wild. The way bro. that was done. Dude. Tell me they survived. Dude, I think Uzi <sighs> took the the brute of it. Dude, that This is like a movie, bro. The fact How, that why his, does this exist? Even his thoughts kind of seemed a little like flooded, if that makes sense. Yeah. Because in the opening we saw him with like covered up where you couldn't really see the the bro older brother's face. I thought he had one more trans transformation in him. I was oh. a little scared about that. I didn't think it was real when they cut off his head. Yeah. But now that the body blew up, now we know. Well, did it blow up? Or, maybe, mm. maybe it's still gonna disintegrate. Maybe it did blow up. Well, yeah, that's true. Man, that was wild, dude. That is so crazy, bro. Dude, Tanjiro, getting that—that's significant, man. That is significant. It went away for a second when he went to that mode. Yeah. I'm. I guess start the fight. <laughs> yeah, I guess. I mean, okay. like, because uh, insane, absolutely insane. Right. You, you've been saying this this whole arc too. Yeah. Well, honestly, the whole show, it felt like movie quality production, and the fight scene was just. I didn't think Tengen was done. I did not think he was done, but I, man, the way he came back with one hand. Yes. Wah, 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 wah. You know what it reminded me of? Okay, I, I know I say this a lot. That's all right. Dragon Ball Z. When when go the future go on, mm -hmm. remember him? Well, he lost his arm, oh, but he was true. taking on two people at once. That's what that remind me of. Yeah. He was just going ham with one arm, and like he was able to read it, like a music, like he was reading the music. Dude, that was like a so beautiful. When he started saying like he hears it, and he the or what do you say tempo or whatever, the, and then he's like ah, yeah, da, 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 going with the song. I guess the explosion at the end was the crescendo. Yeah, it was like the yeah. final. The final. I was because I was thinking I was like, this is kind of like a climax thing. Yeah. I was like, all right. Here comes the crescendo. Man, oh, that, but he was going in, and the fact we've been praising Tanjiro and we've been praising the other two as well. The fact that. He was able to see them both, and he's, it's almost like slow motion. He still had it in him. Like, oh my goodness, when the demon kept messing with him. Yeah, oh man. I felt bad. I was like, bro. Because I, I literally didn't know what he was going to do. Like I didn't either. Well, I mean, he's out of energy. He's damaged. And there's no really way to escape this guy. No one can save you. Except Nesco. That was the only thing I could think of. And I'm... It's, you're looking around for hope, and you, it's almost like you don't see any. Yeah. And then, like, that's why he's just, like, talking. Okay, let me just 
If he's asked me a question, if I answer it, maybe my life will be around a little bit longer. And then he breaks his fingers. It's like, it's a crazy person you're trying to talk to. Like, this, nothing you think of is going to make sense. I was like, okay, I thought he was going to cry out for Nezuko. Nezuko He didn't. Then he took off running. I was like, this is so weird. But you know what? You know what? He doesn't want to turn into a demon. Yeah. I thought he might lie. But then when he didn't, I was like, oh, that makes sense. That's Tanjiro. He's yeah. not going to, he's not going to do that. And he took off running and then he did what he did against Gyo. Yeah. And he's, he, he threw the, you know, the axe up in the air and then kept going. But mm -hmm. like, it was a distraction. Like he deceived him. And then when he got that kunai, man. Yes. Dude. Oh, I thought he, oh, I thought that was going to be the perfect opportunity to cut his head. He I'm so glad Tengen came back though. Yeah. I mean, that was a perfect plan. Mm -hmm. Even. He, no, sorry, 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 sorry. Like, it was like a perfect plan it for was. someone who like literally had nothing else going for him. Like, and I think now uh, it looked like Zenitsu acted like he was down for the count too, yeah. but he was just waiting for the perfect opportunity, the one in a million chance, which we saw. And if, you know, shoot, it was probably like two in a million chance once Tengen came in. Uh, <laughs> even the, even I mean, the odds there. What is it? Light? What is it? Uh, light speed? Godspeed. Godspeed. That reminded me of. You've seen Hunter Hunter. Oh yes. Yeah. Kia. You get Kilo, Godspeed. Kilo, yeah. Yeah. Hey, that's another anime y'all trying to get into. Great. Man. There, there you go. Hunter Hunter. This episode, though, there was not a moment where I was not. What's what not engaging? To... Yeah, it was just right when it started. I was like, dude, there's defeat. Mm -hmm. And then like it just you, kept you going. can feel it, you dude. Just, yeah. That's why I'm saying it's like so cinematic. It's like you feel the sound. It's not. It's not the sound that I'm talking about. But it's like. You know when you see the the you'll feel the sound like the vibrations or whatever mm -hmm. you know it's like the the what, what do they call those theaters that have all the oh, motions like, like and the 4d experience all that stuff thing. yeah it's like that and you see all the visuals and everything but it's like you're there in the the show seeing it and it's all happening bro it's, it's it feels so real but that's crazy like animation i wonder how much money goes to just making okay they do a great job they do a great job but i'm wondering these other animes that i was trying to look forward to like you already know what i'm looking for mm -hmm. where are they at with this you know it's like this is like why hey, why can't you see something like this every time that's why they released the moving train arc and the theater yeah they're like let's get some funding for the next arc because we're gonna need it but and they, they pulled it off but literally it looks the same the animation oh, oh, yeah, on yeah. the anime versus it's honestly incredible and the fact that the, the storytelling i mean they were able to make me feel like there is no hope like thinking i'm gonna need someone outside to show up because oh, nobody yeah. else here has anything left like tandro not only did he have nothing left and he already had <laughs> the sword tied to his hand the other hand is now nerfed too yeah and then when they brought back that glimmer of hope from tandro like they're literally never giving up and he was saying it in the fight don't give up don't give up and then oh, and then oh, everybody just started, started coming back. Tengen came back, and then Inosuke came back. I don't know about Inosuke's excuse. I don't know how you're going to be able to start shifting organs around on the body. I don't know. Maybe he's a sound ninja, too. Because, oh, well, I guess he does. What does he do? Is beast breathing? That's what he calls it? Yeah. I mean, he he said he was flexible. He is. I don't know. Remember, he, he lays on his stomach and then puts his legs over yeah. his head like that? But I don't know how he would move your internal organs like that. I'm going to chalk it up to an anime. Yeah. <laughs> hey. I don't know either. I was, I was, yeah, I'll say it anime possible but that was so great because it's like they they took all hope away and they brought it back and then the the crescendo the final the final piece when you see their heads rolling together i was kind of hoping to see a little more of that but i guess we'll see it next week too it was just wild and then we saw the change with Kandro. Mm, oh yeah his hair like goes up and turns like a little reddish kind of like his dad did when or the, at least the picture showed when they always talk about Muzan. But that mark obviously is significant though. It, and thanks to uh, Rengoku's dad, we learned that. But I mean, he didn't think he was about, he didn't think he was significant yeah. because he didn't think he was born with that stuff. Right. It went away whenever he activated and his pupils went away too. I mean, that's, oh my that's the closest thing I would super saying I would say to Demon Slayer, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Not to mention he was stabbed in the mouth. In the mouth while he did that, yeah. But now the demon exploded. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he got out of the way in time, but I'm thinking what happened is Tengen took the brute of it. I um, mean, he's poisoned right now. Unless. You think Nesco? I've been waiting for the, the. Okay, the cool thing is humans were the ones that were able to defeat both demons. 
Mm -hmm. And that's, I think that's really cool for the fact that they go on bragging all this time about, oh, become a demon, like he did to Tanjiro, what the other, what Kaza did to Rengen, like, you can protect your sister, you can do this, you can accomplish your goals if you become a demon, but yeah, no, because it's light, there's beauty in life and right. death, and the fact that he was standing his ground, none of them were faltering at all, and then they still were able to push past his limits, mm -hmm. to set their hearts ablaze, to never give up, yeah, to be flashy, whatever you want to say, they were able to do it. And without Nezuko's help, now I still think Nezuko needs to be that, me that medical ninja here somehow. She, I, I think her fire can heal people. Yeah. Tengen needs that arm back. I think Tengen got stabbed again in the stomach. Tanjiro's oh, got did. poison too. Yeah, that's right. And then Inosuke. Um, I Inosuke, don't know what's wrong with like. I think Inosuke needs it the most. Because, I mean, if that's anywhere close to his organs, he gonna bleed out. Uh, and Zenitsu, honestly, the way, with that guy's speed mode, he could have pulled like every muscle in his leg. Yeah. Using it twice. That's true. They all need sensu beans. They need it. <laughs> all... Hey, but Tengen's wives are there, so maybe I they mean, have something too. When the when was it was was Chester was what Wisteria Wisteria oh, Wisteria yeah yeah maybe that has effects positive effects on humans but negative effects on on humans so maybe yeah I don't know. My only experience with Shinobis are really from Naruto, so I think that Sakura Sakura or Lady Sonata would be able to sew that arm back on. It would be so funny if they come down and goes, ah, the same arm as last time, and they're fixing it. That would be funny. <laughs> He's like, ha, ha, ha. But, like, stitch it. Yeah. Now I'm starting to think back to what he said in the last episode. He's like, you know what? Someday I'm going to die. I was like, dang. Then I was like, dang, why, 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 like, why do you say that? But hopefully we see him actually recover and survive, because mm -hmm. this will be, what, the first Hashira now that we see survive? Yeah, and they, they said they wanted to retire after this one. Yeah. Kill one one upper moon and then retire. Yeah. I hope when they met retire, they actually met retire and not like... No. Oh. Yeah, you yeah, know. I hope not. Yeah. <laughs> I was just saying, you know. But dude, this episode was it's crazy. I'm always looking forward to the next episode. That, bro... Oh, man. I'm hoping for that 45 minutes. Because that's I, what we need. I'm hoping for 45 minutes, too. But I'm, I'm hoping for a new arc. In general, oh, like quickly, not not just like wait another year. I want to like get give me one next month. Hopefully, we won't have to wait as long as we did last time. Like we'll have to wait for the movie, and then we'll have to wait for the movie to get released again as a series, and then for the the next season, to yeah, start, the real season. So hopefully that doesn't happen. We just jump into a new se a season. Who do you think the next Hashira is probably gonna be? Oh man, you know what? I don't from the looks of it. He didn't have, and I'm gonna butcher the name of it, a Sugoro, some, like somebody that he's training to be the next Hashira. Mm -hmm. So, because we have two open spots, it might be the only other ones we've seen. The yeah. guy that prays, yeah. and then maybe even Shinobu. Um, I feel like the one who prays is gonna be next for some reason. And there's also the there's crazy people in this world. There's a guy that had the ability to, to pick up the sword and become a Hashira in two mm -hmm. months. And there could be someone else out there that could just pick up a sword and take the place. That's true. Hey, yeah, that's true. That's possibilities. I mean, I'm I'm still wondering, and I'm looking forward to also, you know, Tanjiro, and finding more about that that scar and him mastering fire breathing, mm -hmm. all of that, um, and just his. I don't know if it's connected to Nesco. But kind of seeing that power and him, maybe they have like a unified ability that they can use, kind of like what they did against Rue. Yeah. Rue. Um, and if they take a page out of these demons' book, they could both be the next Hashira. Yeah. Like as one unit. Exactly. And then they just have one other open spot out there. And then, like, on top of that, like, I just want to know more about if Tandra will be able to control Nesco's, like, rage mode. Mm. So maybe, maybe, like, if you get down to reps. She lethal. I mean, she was toying with Daki. So, she, oh yeah. And they had trouble with her. So. Shoot, she might have been able to just 1v1 the other guy. Yeah. Kitaro. Uh, Kitaro. I mean, not anymore. He gone. That's true. So, sorry. Not sorry. <laughs> <laughs> they, they had it coming. So, yeah, oh, but that was, oh, those, yeah. those are things I'm looking forward to, though. Yeah, that same thing. The mystery of the scar. And I guess what I'm looking forward to and not looking forward to. Is I'm looking forward to seeing the Hashira Tengen 
being alive. Yeah. Like, I don't necessarily want it to be super easy where there's like a snap of the fingers and everybody's healthy again, but ability for them all, a way for them all to be able to recover. Yeah. Whether it's going back to the butterfly mansion or maybe it's Nezuko being able to kind of like do a instant heal, but just a little bit, like you still need to recover. I just really don't want them to, to die here. Yeah. Maybe it'd be one of those things where he'll recover, but he can never fight again as an Hashira. I would. It'd be sad, but I'd be okay with that. Yeah, I'd be okay with that. At least you live to, you know, and kind of have your wish low low key, but, you know, probably, probably not in a way that you would like it. I mean, and we have to remember how huge this is. The upper moons have been around for centuries. For all we know, they could send every, like, it could, this could honestly be you beat an upper moon and it's your death. Yeah. Like, all the other upper moons come for you at the same time. Right. Oh, so yeah. I'm kind of, like, nervous for that. And I'm obviously you gotta keep we gotta keep in mind moves on too because he can one shot these demons anytime he feels like it. So they are a long ways from like being up there, mm -hmm. but slowly but surely, unfortunately through many trials and almost near death experience or no actually near death experience they are they are getting there. So hopefully we'll see them up top some sometime as this. Art continues, but yeah, there's a, there's a lot to this one. Oh, yeah. Thank you all for watching and supporting our channel. Don't forget to check out our social media accounts. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Leave a comment down below. Let us know what you think about this episode reaction and review. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, and Rumble. You can also follow our friends on YouTube as well. Jay Frizzle Clammy, Bloxing for Gaming. Rich Aladdin for short films and a feature film that's coming out on Apple TV soon. Orc Text Away for Sermons, Thought You Should Know podcast that talks about all things mental health, and Gloom Foundry for fitness and fitness merch. That said, I'm Devin. I'm Noah. And we'll see y'all next time. Peace!